Hey everybody, Rick Needham, handicapping thoroughbred racing from Santa Anita Park on Saturday afternoon, January the 14th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle Southern California thoroughbred race of the day. Let's take a look at race 8 to feature 4.07 p.m. Pacific Post Time. This is the San Fernando Stakes, 8.5 furlong route test on the dirt grade 2 four-year-olds racing for 100 and fifty thousand dollars contenders number one prayer for relief number eight tapazar number five irish art and number seven first strike number one prayer for relief takes a class drop of six units this afternoon is the overall speed leader in this stakes field racing at or about today's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the dirt has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five winning three times in this recent streak of racing consistency Jockey Rafael Bejarano and trainer Bob Baffert send her to the post for the Saturday feature. They've whacked the tote board with 62% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number 8, Tapazar, who's the morning line favorite, has also turned in a quartet of power runs in his respective last five adventures, also winning three times. Race 8 summary, number 1, prayer for relief, tops my contenders list today, which also includes the favorite, number 8, Tapazar, number 5, Irish Art, and number 7, First Strike, 1857. In the 8th today from Santa Anita, the $150,000 grade 2, grade two San Fernando Stakes. Some bonus long shots for you to ponder today. Let's go to uh, Beulah Park, race one, number five, Feisty Me, a 15 to one bomb, takes a 13 level class drop. The overall speed leader in this claiming field, sprinting at or about today's distance of five and one half furlongs on the dirt. Charlestown, race two, entry number eight, Coovey Avenue, a five to one shot, qualifies as a Trackmaster plus power pony and has hit the board in power run fashion in two of her last four, including a power run win in her fourth race back. So handicapping from Santa Anita on a Saturday afternoon, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winner's Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.